Hello, I'm Vishal, a cloud support engineer here at the AWS office in Melbourne, Australia. Today, I'm going to show you how to troubleshoot the Amazon Workspaces system errors by restoring or rebuilding the workspace. Let's get started. You can resolve critical workspaces errors or failures by using the restore or rebuild feature. To restore a workspace, the workspace must have a state of available, error, unhealthy, or stopped. A workspace in rebooting state cannot be restored. Snapshots of the workspace must show timestamp for restore. After signing into the AWS Management Console, open the Workspaces Console. In the Navigation pane, choose Workspaces. Select the workspace to restore. And then choose Actions, Restore Workspace. Under Snapshot, select the Snapshots timestamp. Choose Restore. Or you can restore the workspace using AWS CLI using this command. When restored, the root volume is restored to the most recent snapshot. Any applications that were installed or system settings that were changed after the most recent snapshot was created are lost. The user volume is recreated from the most recent snapshot. The current contents of the user volume are overwritten. Next, to rebuild the workspace, Workspace must have a state of available, error, unhealthy, stopped, or rebooting. Snapshots of the workspace must show timestamp for restore. To rebuild the workspace, open the Workspaces console. In the Navigation pane, choose Workspaces. Select the workspace to rebuild and choose Actions, Rebuild Workspace. Under Snapshot, select the Snapshots timestamp. Choose Rebuild. Or you can rebuild the workspace using AWS CLI using this command. When you rebuild, the root volume is refreshed with the most recent image of the bundle the workspace was created. Any applications that were installed or system settings that were changed after the workspace was created are lost. The user volume is recreated from the most recent snapshot. The current contents of the user volume are overwritten. Automatic snapshots are used when rebuilding a workspace and are scheduled every 12 hours. These snapshots of the user volume are taken regardless of the health of the workspace. When you choose Actions, Rebuild Workspace, the date and time of the most recent snapshot is shown. The primary Elastic Network interface is recreated. The workspace receives a new private IP address. And now you know how to troubleshoot the workspace system errors by restoring or rebuilding workspace. Thanks for watching and happy cloud computing from all of us here at AWS.